new release for Maple MBAC now supports the use of Capella viewpoint requirements. Let's look at how teams using Capella platform can benefit from the feature and convenience of Maple MBAC when updating the system model. Using Maple MBAC, you can easily manage the requirements in your Capella model. You can use Maple MBAC to input new requirements into the model, maybe back to Capella, or you can access the requirements that are already in your Capella model. Say in your Capella model, you have used the requirements view add-on to import requirements, define new attributes, enumerations, and types for your requirement. Maple MBAC will be able to access the different attributes and enumeration and display it in Excel. You can then make changes to these attributes and save them back to the model. You can also add new relations that connect the requirement to different model elements. You can also add new requirements, define its type and attributes. Or if you want to import new requirements to a project or an existing project with Capella types already defined, you can import the requirement into Maple MBAC, easily set the types and the attributes and save it back to your Capella model. I have Maple MBAC connected to a Capella model with requirements. The contact sheet gives an idea of what each worksheet is about. Example, the requirements import worksheet can import new requirements to the model and the requirement sheet is used to set the type for the requirement and you can also relate the requirement to different model elements, for example the physical component in this view. The relation matrix it shows the requirements that are related to physical components. Finally, the status table which is used to set the review status for the requirement as either pending or reviewed. So for example, if I want to include a new requirement, let's say with an ID R31 and call it LCT SU and the requirement text as the LRS shall provide communication between surface user and earth. You can see the requirement is also synced with the other worksheets. Now to set a type for the requirement, I'm going to set it as requirement as defined in Capella. I'm going to now click on the save button and in Capella we'll be able to see this new change once I refresh. Now you can see the new requirement and if I open the specification you are able to see the type as requirement. For the different types of requirements we have defined in Capella, Maple MBC can easily help you manage your requirements.